So we're about 20 days away from the first part of the final season of season four. Wait, let me not confuse myself anymore or confuse y'all because there's a trailer that came out that's promoting and hyping up the final season part three, part one. I don't make the rules. What's going on, everyone? It's your boy Ooze back in once again with another reaction. And uh, this one I kind of let slip under my nose. I actually have a list of uh, videos that I'm trying to actually do in, in a sequence so, so I can keep up with all my projects. And um, I totally missed out on reacting to this when it actually dropped a few weeks ago. So obviously, you know, better late than never. And obviously, for those that know, I'm a big fan of Attack on Titan. I've been following it ever since it, you know, like the anime was a thing. And then I quickly went right over to the manga. So, yes, I am one of the manga readers, but I'm not the kind of manga reader that's going to like literally like brag about it or whatever. I will say that based on my knowledge of what happens and don't worry, I'm not going to spoil anything. I do know and I've known for a while that there was no way the final season, as they dubbed it, would truly be the final season without them cutting it up into several different parts. And that's exactly what's been happening over the last several years. So let me just, you know, I'm getting all this obvious stuff out of the way or maybe for those that maybe that don't know. So hopefully, yeah, you learned something today. But yes, this is Attack on Titan final season part three, which is part one, because this trailer is hyping up the special it's a one hour special part one for whatever reason it's not going to be like multiple episodes they're basically giving us two in one essentially which begs the question why are they doing this i feel like they're just trying to milk it in a sense to really elongate and let this hype around the fact that this is it after this is nothing else unless they decide to like make some sort of movie or continue the story in whatever weird ass way that's neither, neither here nor there let's just see this trailer and let's get right into it wow my bun is looking crazy today <laughs> oh they're subs cool Rumbling, rumbling is coming. Yup. Oh, so what was it? It said March twenty, March third. Wow, second core. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm like trying to catch it while it's going. So first core premiere on uh, March twenty third this year, obviously, right? And then the second core scheduled for 2023, no date exactly as to when, um, but I would presume that it's gonna happen at some point in the fall or even pushing it as far as like later, later, like November and even December, which I hope that we don't have to wait that long, but there it is. So obviously um, without really spoiling anything, there's really not much else to take from this trailer. This is a teaser at, you know, after all. So obviously it's like, again, it, it's really not something that you can really pull from aside from the obvious, because this is clearly the rumbling that the last season of course had. And uh, yeah, if it wasn't already obvious, uh, there's a humongous weird looking Titan that is being formed. And there's a whole lot of big old colossal sized titans that are a part of this rumbling for those that maybe forgot what happened in the last season or the last part i should say because you know that's what it is um yeah uh it's like this is a really really short teaser nothing too crazy like i'm saying um but that's kind of like the nature of what teasers are uh there's it's not this is not like a dragon ball teaser where like there's like one little frame of something new that i can like just pull out and make this a whole 10 minute video but that that's not that's not happening but because it is an hour um i guess what i will more than likely do is make an attempt to do a reaction video for it for you guys and i'll try to get the homie brother ooch on there all right so that way it's the two of us you could y'all could look forward to that and i'm trying to let me actually see 
when March 3rd actually is. Uh, that's on a Friday. Interesting. So if that's Japan time, then that means that it's going to possibly release on Thursday, depending. But it really depends on exactly um, when it airs in Japan. It says that it's premiering at 0025. I don't know military time. I'm sorry. I would assume because of the nature of attack on titan that it would air at a like you know like at a later time like in the evening you know what i'm saying like it is pretty wild you know what i'm saying like it's pretty gruesome it can get pretty gruesome and this is like we're we're at the we're at the very end game here of the series um and one thing i guess i can leave you guys with is i truly wonder based on the events that happen and obviously this is more for the manga readers but again i'm not going to spoil anything so don't worry if you haven't read it i i do really wonder if they're going to take any liberties with the ending um because you know uh i don't i don't i don't personally remember how um the internet handled the ending of how the manga ended i just remember there was a lot of mixed reactions and because of those mixed reactions i feel like because they were mixed and they not they weren't just so like crazy good or like you know what i'm saying like that can be taken and looked at like it was a bad thing i'm wondering if you know because this is an, an adaptation i'm i'm curious if they're gonna change it at all to maybe give us a different outcome that negates what happens at the end but again i'm not trying to give too much i'm not trying to give anything away you know but i'm being very cautious with my words just know that the way the manga ended it didn't really give people like a good kind of wow feeling and emotion if that makes sense so obviously we're gonna have to wait and see but it is what it is and i'm looking forward to it of, of course i'm hopefully hopefully hoping that you guys i can't speak that are also just as excited um attack on time has been around for a long time you know and it's kind of crazy that it's finally ending but remember when they had like a four to five year hiatus like what the can we do we forget about that like that's insane like that actually happened like you know then they got better over time you know after like you know the, the drought between season one and season two i really do wonder how they're gonna handle that ending if they're gonna just do one to one and just be and you know keep the integrity of it or if they're gonna you know take a little bit of a risk and you know do a little bit more and something that we maybe we don't expect and i wonder if they're gonna do a movie because usually you know the thing is uh, this is the last thing i'll say i'm sorry the last thing I want to say, I guess ask a question or not really a question. It's more of like a general statement, but I feel like Attack on Titan is obviously popular enough to do a movie. And I'm pretty sure, you know, based on the story, you know, a lot of folks would probably be like, well, why would they do that? Or what would they do it of? Would it be a continuation of the events in the manga or would they just adapt something else? Like, because Attack on Titan has been so popular, it has several side mangas. You know what I'm saying? There's uh, Before the Fall. I know that actually got a, uh, a few episodes and I think about that. But there's another one um, that it, it it has it takes place before the events of the start of where the, of the manga starts. It's about a character that was born. They call it the son of a titan. It's only it's not really uh, metaphorical is the wrong term, but it just it was presented in such a way that the the mother of this child was pregnant and the titan ate her but when they uh, when they were able to kill this titan i don't remember if they if it like threw this lady up or something but they were able to retrieve that that corpse and you know they were able to essentially save the baby so because of that people like feared this child so i wonder if like they could do i mean they could really if they want to because of the namesake they could they could essentially just animate anything attack on titan that they just haven't or like gotten around to yeah i guess what i want to say is like do y'all think that they're gonna you know once this is all said and done are they gonna have a movie you know of some sort are they gonna figure out a way to just keep giving us like some sort of attack on titan anime because again it is very popular and when it comes down to business, usually when things are very popular, they try to keep, you know, not just milk it, but they really try to 
keep making you know as much money as they can off of it because there's no reason to stop you know what i'm saying but i don't know it is what it is it really depends on the company and the direction and whatever so that's it out of me enough rambling and rumbling rambling i don't know sorry like share subscribe hit me up let me know your comments your thoughts all in the comment section below uh, i want to hear your thoughts maybe we could bring it up on another video or something like that um, I'll more than likely mention this on the Full Power Podcast. If you haven't uh, subscribed to that channel, please go ahead um, and do so. There's going to be a link in the description um, there as well. And um, if you were probably wondering, like, oh, like, why does my room lit up like this? Well, this is my stream lighting. So I'm actually going to hop on stream after I'm done recording this. So definitely check me out on Twitch. I know that obviously this video is going to be put out whenever and obviously like you but yeah just go ahead and follow me on twitch as well link in the description below and uh, make sure you guys take your camera yourselves may the power take you the lock loaded right here on this channel stay safe stay clean stay inside we'll see you guys next time